I'm joined by Jennifer Lonsdale, who's Director of the Environmental Investigation Agency, who's just formed a partnership with the Global Ocean Race. Jennifer, can you explain slightly what, uh, what the partnership's about? Yes, what we want to achieve with the Global Ocean Race is uh, setting high standards for environmental behaviour for sailors around the globe. We also want to uh, publicise the very important need for any mariner who's involved in a collision with a whale to, pr to report this to the International Whaling Commission or indeed to the Global Ocean Race. And you, you've been here for, for a few days now and you've been chatting with the teams informally and you've given a presentation. Has the, has the take-up, has the enthusiasm been strong for this? We're terribly excited because the sailors are very keen to participate. They see they're launching something new and that could make uh, an enormous difference to uh, knowledge of the oceans. We call them the eyes of the ocean and they've really taken that on board. We provided um, a little uh, form for them to be able to uh, record the data. They also have those uh, forms electronically. They um, are all set up with their cameras and uh, I'm so excited about the enthusiasm that they've shown. It's amazing, the, the sort of flow of data is actually going to be quite impressive. They're very sophisticated yachts, they've got very sophisticated communication systems. Um, obviously they can send material back while they're at sea, but also in the stopovers. One of the good things about this race is it pulls into port. We'll be able to uh, pick a whole load of very fascinating data up, I imagine. Yes, we're hoping that when they write their blogs and their emails back as they're sailing, if they see something exciting, we hope they're going to write um, in those blogs, include information about the marvellous sights they've seen, or even perhaps actually some really tragic things. Um, and we'll be able to include those on updates of the race. Um, we'll also, if it's something terribly important, we'll provide it to the scientists who are interested in following what we're doing and are looking forward to development of the programme. When they get to the various stopovers, we'll download their images and they can start it over all over again for the next leg. So, as we said before, this is something that's new. It's something that uh, we're pioneering with this race and we'll just see how it expands and we can then promote it to other sailors um, in the future. Now, the yachts in this race are going to go through the Southern Ocean, through the very high latitudes and places that it's impossible for research vessels to go on a financial or even a, a range basis. And so this makes the information that they're going to retrieve extremely valuable. Well, this is what we're so excited about. It is a new research project. We've never done it before. Sailors are going to places other boats can't go and they're going to be able to take images of, of things that they see which perhaps we've never seen before. Or play, maybe there will be species in places that um, people didn't expect them to be. It really is a remarkable um, programme and we think these six boats are going to be able to pioneer a whole new area of research for, for scientific knowledge. They really are the eyes of the ocean.